Hey everybody, it's Terrence and I am back with another video. First and foremost, I want to say if I sound a little weird, it's because I'm congested and I have absolutely no clue as to why my nose decided to, like, stuff and clog and be disgusting. Like, I don't know. I do want to apologize for being MIA for the last couple months. I did kind of lose my whole passion for YouTube. I don't... I mean, I don't know what else to say other than that. Um, I am going to jump right back on as if I never left. And uh, so, yeah, let's uh, just jump right into this video. If you clicked it, you already know what's going on. So let's do it. I love taste testing. I love snackage. So let's get right to it. So like I said, um, we're going to do a taste testing today here with my trusty compatriot Pudge Pudge. He's over here. He looks like a dirty mop right now. So we're not going to put him really in the camera. I need to get him groomed. We're not worried about that. Anywho, um... So, for those of you who don't know me on a personal level, I love snacks, I love sweets, I love treats, I love sweet stuff. I'm really surprised that I've never gotten a cavity before, like, ever. But, anywho, there is this new place in North Carolina where I live that has just opened up called Duck Donuts. If you heard of them, cool. If not, that's better, I guess. I don't know. It just opened up here. I've never had Duck Donuts before, so I decided, you know... I've heard a little bit about it, so why not go and try some of the donuts? I just got a half dozen to start out with because I really don't know, like, the flavors and I don't know what's going on. So, I'm going to test the flavors with you guys, give you my review of each one of the flavors, and then we'll keep it moving, cool? Hopefully this is great, because I've heard a bunch of good things about this place. So... The donuts are real pretty. I don't... Okay, this is not a good angle for this. Oh, they're going to slide all over. Okay, anyway, this is some of the donuts. Well, this is the half dozen of donuts that I got. Um, some of them have, like, real specific names. Like, I know that this uh, white and chocolate one here is called Vanilla Zebra. This is one is Strawberry Lemonade. I want to say this one is called Cocoa at the Beach. I think this uh, white one here might just be called The Beach. This is the Maple Bacon one, which I heard a lot about. I heard that it was really good. And I cannot, for the life of me, remember what this um, this yellow one is called. I think this just might be a lemon glazed one. I'm not really 100%. Um, Doug Donuts, if you watch this, please don't like chastise me for not knowing the names. We're going to try each one of these, and I'm going to let you guys know like what is like the best one and all that stuff. Cool? Alright. So I got my agua here because uh, there's a lot of sweetness going in my face at one time. Alright, so this is the... Oh, look at that. It pressed against the side. I'm so sad about that. Anyway, this is the strawberry lemonade donut. I think it's just a strawberry glaze with like lemon icing. Ooh, that hard too. Okay. So, we're gonna... Oh, man. Yo. This legit tastes like strawberry lemonade. Like, there's only a little bit of the lemon frosting. But it's so good. And the donut, like the actual donut part, is just a plain donut. And it's like, so soft. Oh, my God. Oh, my goodness, man. Alright, so that was the strawberry lemonade donut. It was really good. Alright, the next donut is this powdered sugar, I think, and chocolate drizzle. Duh. I'm sorry. But this is the second one. It got a little bit of uh, some white glaze on it, but whatever. We'll just bite from this side. Um, I want to say that this one is called Cocoa at the Beach. Again, um, I don't know. Let's go. Oh my god. All right, so again, it's just a plain donut. I think that was cinnamon sugar on top. Maybe okay, that one was good. It was not good as good as the strawberry lemonade one, but that one was decent. See you, Zuck. I see you, Zuck. Donut. All right. So this next one is the one that I absolutely 100% cannot remember. I think it just has a lemon glaze on it. So let's uh. Do this. Oh my god, yes. This is the, this one has a lemon glaze on it. This one has a lemon glaze on it. I love lemon. I like I love lemon flavoring. It kinda mm, 
I'm sorry. I'm sorry if you guys think this is real gross. Like, it's so good though. It kind of tastes like, like the Betty Crocker ice cream. I don't know. Because my mom used to, or my mom makes lemon cakes. And she like melts the Betty Crocker like lemon icing over top of like her lemon cakes. And it's really good. It kind of reminds me of that. Like, just like a lemon cake. That's kind of what it tastes like. Um, I think the fact that the donut is plain kind of adds to the effect of the, um, the icing or whatever is on top of your donut because it, like, gives it a flavor, I guess, to balance out. But, I mean, that one wasn't bad. It just reminded me of, like, a lemon cake that my mom made, which I guess is a good thing because it reminds me of my mom, but, nah. So, next one is the one, like, I remember this name because I thought it was real weird. This one is the Vanilla Zebra. Good lord, I hope that's right. Anyway, Vanilla Zebra, it's vanilla glaze with chocolate icing. I don't know. Or chocolate, no, vanilla glaze with chocolate drizzle. They might, they might all just be icing. I don't know. Okay. Not a big fan of that one, just because um, I'm not a big fan of like chocolate icing on like, on, like a chocolate covered donut, you know what I mean? And that's kind of just what it tastes like. It just tastes like a chocolate donut. Like, not a chocolate donut, but a regular donut with chocolate icing on top of it. Like, it's. <gasps> oh, PSR, you guys can hear a sound in the background. Um, My AC is on because it's real hot. Like, this is not okay. Next donut is. I want to say that this one was called The Beach. It looks like The Beach is all sandy. I think it's um vanilla icing with cinnamon sugar. I really need to check out their, like, the names of these things. Because it's, uh, I don't know. Anyway. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. That one was good. Oh yeah. That one was good. That one was really good. Jeez. That tastes like. I really can't, like, I know what it tastes like. I know what this is. I don't know. The taste of the cinnamon sugar is really, really, like, pungent. Like, it's really, really, really there. As you guys saw, the top of it was kind of coated in all of the cinnamon sugar. And then it had the vanilla, I think, around it, I guess, to hold the cinnamon sugar on. I don't know. It was really good. Um, yeah. I can dig it. So, last one is the one that I heard about the most. It is the maple bacon donut. I'm so excited. Oh, oh man, icing's coming off. Okay. Oh, maple icing. Okay. So, maple icing with bacon bits. Let's uh do this thing. I'm real. Oh, it's like melty over there. Too. It just tastes like breakfast. Like, if you have pancakes and freaking bacon. Like, it's not like, oh my god, this is the best thing ever. But it's definitely not gross. It's definitely like more. Like sweet places should incorporate bacon. Do you guys remember when freaking Burger King did that bacon Sunday? Like, that was literally the best thing in my whole life. Like, that bacon Sunday was my life. I literally went for like a whole week straight and got one like every day. I wish they had put like two strips of bacon in it and not just one, but it was so good. And people were like, oh my god, you're so gross. Why do you eat that? It is so, so good. Like, I wish Burger King would redo that because it was the best. <gasps> I would have to say that my favorite one was, they all have bites out of them now, but this one, the, I guess, vanilla glaze with the pow, I mean, the cinnamon sugar on top, that was my absolute favorite one out of the bunch just because cinnamon sugar, like, I love that combination. The... <laughs> This is so ratchet. Okay, my second favorite would have to be the strawberry lemonade because this one was real, real good. Oh, there are bacon pieces definitely falling off. The maple bacon one was probably my third favorite just because it just tastes like, like, it's breakfast. And who doesn't, oh my God, it's so good. And who doesn't like breakfast? Like, you know what I mean? I can feel myself getting more and more congested as this, this video goes on and I hate everything. All right, my fourth favorite would just be the plain lemon glazed one. Um... Just, again, that reminds me of a cake that my mom would make. And if I'm going to, like, a place to actually buy things, I, 
like it's nice that it reminds me of mom but also like i want something extraordinary i want something extravagant i don't know what i was thinking i was just like hey throw some random things in there and they were like okay this one's good this one's good this one's good and i was like okay i'm gonna take your word for it because it's my first time here. uh please don't think i'm gross you guys i'm really not <laughs> uh, okay and my least favorite again just because i'm not a big fan of chocolate donuts would be oh you can't see that would be the vanilla zebra i thought it would taste um more vanilla y i guess but the chocolate is kind of really super overpowering again them all being on the plain donuts kind of enhances the flavor of each one and makes each one unique I kind of thought it would have the same like undertone taste of that plain donut. Each, oh, I can feel my, I can hear myself being, oh, this is the worst. Anyway, um, like none of them tasted like plain donuts at all. And I really, really like that. All right, so that brings us to the end of this video. I'm about to go brush my teeth because I feel like it's a bunch of like just sugar just in my mouth right now. I love it, but I also hate it. So again, this place was called Duck Donut. If you have one near you at all, you should definitely check them out. They have some really unique flavors. Um, I like that they name each one of the donuts like a different thing. I thought that was really, really cool. Uh, yeah, that was pretty much it. I'm definitely gonna check this place out again and get some different flavors. If you guys would like to see me taste test that, please let me know below. If you've been and you have any suggestions for any like combinations of flavors, let me know. Like, let me know whatever. Cool. All right. So I do definitely appreciate each and every one of you for watching. Like I said, I'm going to be back on YouTube with a vengeance because I'm like, I feel terrible. If you guys have any suggestions for videos, you want me to do more taste testing, um, more clothes unboxing, more just style guides, more talking about random crap from my life. Just let me know below. I would love to have conversations with you guys. Just talk to me, cool? Because I'm, I'm a people, like the people. Please nobody flame me for my hat because I love Team Mystic when Pokemon Go was what, a thing for two seconds. Like, that was that was Team I got and I loved it. Um, anyway, I'm dragging, I'm dragging. Uh, if you are not already and you would like to, definitely subscribe, give me a thumbs up, give me comments. Like I, like I said, I want to have conversations with you guys. And if you would like, you can follow me on Instagram, same name here, Hello Terrence, three O's, one R, uh, my Snapchat, my all my social media, look me up by Hello Terrence with three O's, one R, and you'll see my face. <laughs> Anywho, um, I love each and every one of you so, so, so much. I hope you have a wonderful day. Be great.